What it do, what it do, what it do. This is your boy, KQ, KC Boxing Network. First of all, I want to thank everybody for your support. Each and every time I do a video, or a live stream, or call a fight, or do the early morning show with my co-host, Knockout Boxing 86 TB. Who is doing his thing. Now. Don't forget. Please. Hit the like button. If you want to donate to the channel. Please. Hit the super thanks. If you like to. Listen to my live stream. I invite you. Monday through Friday. 11 o'clock a.m. Central Standard Time. I will be live tomorrow. And we will talk about the greatest and the latest in the sport of boxing. You can call me the news of boxing. Because if it's news in boxing, you're going to hear about it. No, I don't do 20 people on a panel. That's just not me. I make my own channel. I don't, now I don't mind people shining. Matter of fact, I have helped out many, many people that can tell you that. But I like for people to know who I am. Now, now I'm going to tell you who Fred Hawthorne is. Now, everyone that knows me knows that I'm an independent thinker. I don't I don't play following the leader in school. Never did, never will. But one thing I will say, I don't do uh, videos either. But when you have a black man that's trying to destroy another black man because he didn't do what he's supposed to do, and he got his credentials taken, he got his reputation taken, he's only four foot something and called himself a basketball coach. That's Fred Hawthorne. He down the black community. He down the black man that wears the gold chains. He commend the jewelers that get their money. These young men that's boxing today, they taking a risk on their lives. These young men today, they are coming from the inner city. Something Fred Hawthorne don't know nothing about that so called volunteering as a basketball coach I guarantee you it's not in Compton Long Beach I guarantee you it's some Catholic school that Lincoln and Kennedy goes to and one thing now I don't put kids or wives in no videos or talk about them but since he did then it's an open book and since he did this open conversation. Make them tough and rough. Because I can see your son getting his ass kicked every five minutes in school. Get him off that piano and put a football in his hand, a basketball in his hand. Not that's what he want to do in life, but that's what kids do in sports. You've been so out of touch so out of touch in the black community because you married outside your race. You invited people to Christmas parties outside your race. You're not comfortable in your skin. I've been sitting back watching you for three years. I've, I mean three years. It's a shame. It is a shame. A black man, even though you're short in stature, Everybody is some for everybody. Now, I'm not going to say how your wife looked and this and that. But you say she got the money. And I'm quite sure she does. But what millionaire sit there and worry about another black man? What millionaire tells Andre Ward, build your own? Andre Ward ain't trying to do that. Stop being stupid. And then another thing. 
Jamel Charlo. If you want to know the truth, I know the truth. Stop the lying. Jamal Charlo came out. He said, listen, I'm going to have to admit, I'm not going to be ready. That is September. I've been out the ring for two years and plus. I'm not going to be ready. So Jamel, he stepped in. Not Al Heyman. Al Heyman didn't pick him. Jamel said, hey, look here, Canelo, you thought my brother was sweet? Well, he's not sweet. But I tell you what, come to me. I take it. So he's jumping up to two weight classes. Something that has been done in the past. A la Roy Jones. So stop the cap. Oh, you want to bet? Let's bet it, y'all. Come on, $500. Let's bet. Uh Uh-uh, Money Brown got it. Uh, ETB, yeah, everything bothers he got. He got money. Listen, why don't you bet on yourself for being a man? Why don't you bet on yourself and putting your foot down? Why don't you bet on yourself and getting a real car aside electricity car? Why don't you bet on yourself and get Kenny Porter back after he slapped the shit out of you? How about that? Why don't you stand up and be a man? You can't walk around the black community because you're not part of it. You're not part of it. Damn people, my loved ones, my queens, my love, my grace, my kings of KQ Wild Wild Network. I'm going to tell you this. You have some people come up in the inner city. Shot town finest. And what did he do? He became a doctor. A doctor. I came up. I'm from the inner city. I worked at a bank. Not a teller. Working in the North American Banking Group. Did investigations on different companies like Duracell. I retired. I retired because I started in high school. The age wasn't there. That's why the pension is not the 100%. But I put my time in. What can we say about you? You're a millionaire. You worry about YouTube. You worry about Al Heyman. You worry about Jamel Charlo. Stop fooling everybody. You're a pawn. You're a pawn. And it's checkmate on your ass. Called Al Heyman. Showtime. They are doing their thing. If Jamel fought, fight Canelo Everett and lose, so what? I'm going to ride with him till the wheels fall off. See, you don't know nothing about that. You don't know nothing about that. But at the end of the day, he would be able to take care of his family, their family, and their family to come. You will never, ever come close to what Jamel Charlo has made or Al Heyman. Oh, you'll never get close to what Al Heyman had ever made. Unless you work your wife to death. Unless you put that whip on her ass. But I think she got that whip on your ass. I never seen a little man. A little man. Less than four foot tall. Trying to act like he's educated. He ran for the Senate. Got two votes. He ran for the city. And do and didn't do anything. I comment on his video. What he do? He bitched up and deleted it. But that's okay. That's why I'm telling you this. Sooner or later, you know how you people are. Some of them in the LWC. Screenshot this and send it to him. Send send it to him. And, and let's see. Will he answer the call? I invite you to come on my show. I invite you. I'll send you the link. Explain your punk ass self. Explain the the Oreo a cookie. Explain it. Explain to me how you have a Christmas party and not one black man or woman was there. Oh, I got to see this. But don't worry. I got the picture. 
You're the only, you're the only dark spot in that picture. Now, I know your wife's embarrassed. They say, hey, we want to meet your husband. Oh, here he come now, coming through the door. Where? Where's he at? They thought you was one of the little kids. They thought you was one of the little kids. And cut that beard off. You ain't Isaac Hayes. You don't even know who Isaac Hayes was. Elijah Muhammad was a good man. He was a man, though. He was a man, though. So don't discredit him. Your hero, Mac and Max, and your wife better not know about it because you'll be out the door. Well, he served and learned everything under the honorable Elijah Muhammad, Hadu Allah. Now, I'm not a black Muslim, but I am orthodox a Muslim. Am I perfect? No. Do I pray? Yes. Three times a day, I'm working on it. But I will tell you this. Stop hating on Al Heyman. You're doing yourself a disservice. You wishing and betting on a black man? I don't want nobody betting this dude. All we can say is go Jamel Charlo. We can say go Al Heyman. Go Stephen F. Sinosa. I'm happy so far with boxing. What about you? Oh, I'm sorry. You must be a coach of a, a basketball team. Half of them players are bigger than you. Hell, I think the ball is bigger than you. You are a punk. You are a squirrel trying to get a nut. That's what you are. Yes, I don't do um, videos like this. This is my first and my last. But you keep it up, Fred Hawthorne. I'm going to ride you and ride you to the wheels fall off. And it will fall off on that electric car you got. I seen one. I said, who the hell plugs up a car? And when you get caught in traffic, you don't have to run, go get a central cord, run across the expressway and plug it up. You about the dumbest millionaire I ever seen, or so-called millionaire. Cause your wife, she got the checkbook. Your wife give you allowance. Anybody, and you know what? I'm sorry, before I get through, I want my $5 back from that infomercial of Nine Wives. This video is longer than nine wives. My people, my loved ones, my wow, wow, chat. I sat there getting ready to watch nine wives. Cause you know me and Fred, we had a conversation and uh, 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 we used to talk. And I kept telling him, stop the BS. But he didn't listen. Now look at him. They ran his ass off the air now. No, don't buy that coaching shit. No, no. You ain't got nothing to do. You're a stay-home father. You missed a daycare. You daddy daycare. Over oh, two kids. One you named Lincoln. They freed the slaves. The other one named Kennedy, who's a Democrat. Through and through. And that's not you. Trust me. Matter of fact, you don't even know where you belong. He had a nerd to talk about the black culture. Right now, these young guys, everything changed in moderation. Everything changed in uh, 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 every 10 years. Right now, jury for the young guys, that's in. That shows that success. Now, some people, their success is their homes, their cars, their bank accounts. What's your success? Well, we and my wife. No, your wife and her family, they got money. Let me enlighten you all. Fred Hawthorne don't have anything. Only thing he has is what his wife has and her father. Oh, yeah, I've been doing some digging. 
This is what I did for 30 years. I was an investigator. Uh, is this a reputable company should we deal with? I work with vice president. Vice president of what now is Chase Bank. I was an investigator for the North American Banking Group. Hey, is, is this okay to deal with? You know, uh, uh, how was your returns last year? How was this and that? And I did it. And I came from the inner city. I retired. I came from the inner city. I was flubbed. What about you? Be careful. Uh, be careful. Because whatever you wish for, you might just get. But you might not get it in the way that you want it. I'm KQ. KC boxing network don't let this little dwarf hookwink you and bamboozle you and lead you astray everything he does he down the black man for wearing a chain he down the black man for trying he don't uplift the black man he unlift the privileged the rich He'd never been into the inner city. That's why he lost in the so-called Senate. Go back and do some research on Fred Hawthorne. Read all about him. The $5, nine wives, that was shot in a one room, all black owned studio, when he could have did it in his house, in one room, your damn bedroom. That's all he had to do. Four people was in that movie. The two Muslims, so-called Muslims, standing at the door. The so-called Elijah Muhammad laying on the gurney. And the lady talking. That's it. That's the movie. No more, no less. Five dollars with interest. I want it back. You a millionaire? Send it to me. And stop acting like you don't know what cash app is. Your ass knew it when you was on the uh, 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 on the um, uh, uh, YouTube, and Andre Ward ain't thinking about building his own. He thinking about taking care of his family the best way he can. He ain't trying to worry about doing this and doing that. Everybody just want to be happy. If it's being happy on what I'm doing, then I'm gonna be happy. With that, I am KQ, KC. Boxing Network. I don't do nothing but tell the truth here. That's all. Yes, I am a member of the LDBC. Some are cool and some are a fool. Why? Because that's how family is. Family is the same way. I got some family members, man, will ride, ride, ride. I got some family members I can't stand. But that's all about it. But at the end of the day, as my son would say, it's all as one. And Fred Hawthorne, get yourself some help. Get yourself some help. Talk to some black professors and not no white ones. While your wife slaving, doing 20 hours a day, trying to make money for you and her, it's not pimping, because she slapped his ass around. So, with that, I am definitely out of here. I am KQKC Boston Network. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe right now. Go ahead and subscribe right now. Because, like I said, Jamil Charlo, he's daring to be great. Sometimes, you got to stick your neck out to be great. You got to take a chance on yourself to be great. If he shall fall, that's all right. Because I'm still going to ride with him. Why? Because he has that mentality that some boxers don't have. He wants to be great. Now, one more thing. I'm so sorry. But when Fred said, oh, 
I, I probably won't be on YouTube or go to a fight for another five, six years. Of course you're not. Because you're barred. Because PBC said no more. Give me no credentials. Don't you come back to another fight. Unless you come out your pocket. And he's not going to do that. Because I'm going to tell you right now. He made a lot of enemies out there. A lot of fighters. And you know what? It's so funny. Earl Spence watches everything. And he watched your ass. I am KQ. KC Boxing Network. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. If you want to hear the real truth. The real truth. Shout out to 78 Sports TV. He rides with me to the wheel fall off. And with that, I'm out of here. Peace and love to everyone. Hadu Allah. I'm sorry I didn't greet you with the ancient word of peace. Assalamu alaikum. And I depart you with the ancient word of peace. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu. And with that, I'm out of here. Peace and love.